question 61 question 61 asks that varieties developed by pure land method are varieties developed by pure line method are now when we talk about the pure line pure line indicate the progeny of single cell fertilized progeny of single cell fertilized homozygous and uniform plant progeny of a single cell fertilized homozygous and uniform plant is called a pure line selection and this is a method of crop improvement so homozygous and uniform varieties are developed by pure line method so b is the correct answer question 62 question 62 to ask that honey is so if we talk about option a it is a nectar of flower not it is the only nectar of flower option b nectar stored in honey sac yes but not only nectar is a honey option c nectar mixed with saliva and stored in honey sac so obvious the honey bee makes 40000 to 80000 trips to a flower and while 40 to 80000 trips to a flower the nectar of flower mixed with the saliva and stored in honey sac so it is a most appropriate answer and option d is the nectar and water sucked by the honey bee no water is not the nectar is the particular answer question 63 question 63 asks that endosulfan is a endosulfan is a type of pesticide so option d is correct question 64 question 64 asks that roquefort cheese roquefort cheese are ripened by growing a blank on them now roquefort cheese is produced by penicillium roqueforti fungi and roquefort cheese is produced on a ripened uh, cheese are ripened by growing a fungus on them which gives them a particular flavor so answer is a fungus that is option a is correct question 65 question 65 asks that molecular scissors used in genetic engineering are now molecular scissors is a term used for restriction enzyme restriction enzymes are the enzymes which cut at a specific site and this restriction enzyme are of two type that is restriction exonucleases and restriction endonucleases restriction exonucleases cut a nucleic acid from the ends whereas endonuclease is cut the nucleic acid from the middle so now in option this restriction endonuclease is given in option so restriction endonuclease is given in option d so that is the correct answer
question 66 question <coughs> 66 asks that technique employed in plant hybridization is technique employed in plant hybridization now in plant hybridization which we can call as a cross hybridization they carry out a process is in first step they perform that is a emasculation and emasculation they remove anther it is known as a removal of anther from the bisexual flower now emasculation occurs then they carry out bagging they cover with a bag of a butter paper now this bag allow the remaining carpel to get mature so when carpel get mature it is debagged so bag is removed it is a debagging now after debagging when carpel get mature the pollen grain of specific plant or desired plant is dusted on the carp stigma of a carpel so it's next step it is a dusting after dusting again there is a need of rebagging so this allow the pollen to develop and fertilization and when rebagging occurs then cross fertilization has happened means we carry out a tagging we provide a tag that cross fertilization happened so this is the correct sequence now in question emasculation is given as option a bagging is given as option b crossing is given option c so all are correct so d is the correct answer question 67 question 67 asks that modern plant breeding started in modern plant breeding started in with the discovery of Mendel's paper in 1900 which was originally published in 1866 okay so Mendel's plant breeding originally published in 1866 but but Rediscovery of Mandel paper occurred during 1900. So, 1900 that is option C is the correct answer. Question 68. Question 68 asks that it is now possible to breed plant and animal with the desired characters. So it is possible to breed plants and animals with desired characters through. So this can be achieved by genetic engineering which is a modern technique. So that is the correct answer that is option C. Question 69. Question 69 asks that haploids are more suitable for mutation. Haploids more suitable for mutation studies than the diploids this is because because haploid plant are always pure and because they possess only one set of chromosome so the mutation express easily because there is no any dominant or alternative gene with that uh, alternative forms of another uh, of that gene so the mutation express easily so because of this they are cons haploids are more suitable so option b is the correct answer that all mutation whether dominant or recessive 
are expressed easily in haploids so b is the correct answer question 70 question 70 asks that which leg secreting insect leg secreting insect undergo death after reproduction so in case of leg producing insect that is a loxifer laca it is a commonly cultured leg insect in this female are viviparous and they produce hundred nymph they produce thousand nymph now after third molt larva pass on to pseudo pupil stage so later male emerge copulate with female and then dies so according to this the male that is option a is correct answer question 71 question 71 asks that plasmids are found in plasmids are double stranded circular dna and these are extra nuclear genetic material it is extra nuclear genetic material it is found exclusively means only in bacteria so option d is correct answer in bacteria when you see there is a nucleus in spite of presence of nucleus there is a double stranded circular dna that is known as plasmid question 72 question 72 asks that ir36 was developed through breeding ir36 developed through breeding and this ir36 in this 13 rice varieties from six countries and Oriza Nibara that is a wild rice of Central India produce early maturing high genetic resistant variety. So thirteen rice varieties from six countries and Oriza Nibara that is a wild crossed and they produce early maturing high yielding resistant variety that is IR36 so option B is correct answer question 73 question 73 asks that which one is paste so if you talk about paste a mouse is obvious paste because it can affect a plant pathogen are also paste insect are also paste so d all is correct answer question 
question 74 question 74 asks that silkworm is a now silkworm is an insect which is a silk moth that is a type of insect which produce silk so it is a moth so c is the correct answer question 75 question 75 asks that which one of the following method is commonly used to maintain genetic trick method used commonly to maintain genetic trait of given plant genetic trait of given plant so the common use method if we talk about maintaining of genetic trait then obviously it should be a vegetative propagation but if we see with the option option a is given by propagating plant through the seed germination if seed germination we are talking that sexual reproduction is occurring and in sexual reproduction variation will occur so it cannot maintain a genetic trait option b propagating through vegetative multiplication yes it can be there option c the genetic hybrid through the intergenetic pollution if intergenetic population will occur then sexual reproduction will occur so it cannot be there and d by treating the seeds with the gamma radiation if we treat the seeds with the gamma radiation seed production is occurring means means it is a sexual reproduction so it cannot be there so b is the correct answer